All set. And away they go. Cinnamon blush about two and a half lengths off the first call, the green and white silk. Spirits at flight towards the back end of the field with Miss Gibson. Shona Kirsty Ives in the blue silk reacted swiftly towards the inside by a length and a quarter, but now taken on by Jade's Cabernet in the yellow silks. And Jade's Cabernet now going to stride over as they tack over to the inside. Chelsea Flower down the middle also tracking over to the inside, probably the overall leader with the white blinkers. Kitten's Adventure Stealth Attack. They're starting to stack up towards the inside. Bird Watchers between them. Tis Magic the Red Cap. Cinnamon Blush trying to close in. Spir Spirited flight on the outside. Inside the final 300 metres, Fashion Mistress moves up to Jade's Cabernet. Looking to run on Kitten's Adventure on the outside. Blush of Dawn, Tis Magic, anybody's race. Kitten's Adventure on the outside. Miss Gibson trying to close in. Spirited flight, the last hundred. Kitten's Adventure, Chelsea Flower on the inside as they come down to the line. It gets close. Kitten's Adventure from Chelsea Flower or Miss Gibson who really took off. Ms. Gibson was taken off and spirited flight just in behind these. Spread across the track, number 10, Kitten's Adventure. For the Gary Rich stable, the Admiral's Kitten, Cole Dickon. Chelsea Flower running over a distance short of her best stays on for second or third because look at this horse, Miss Gibson might grab second. Let's have a look, Kitten's Adventure. Second position gets tight. Nine. Miss Gibson, perhaps. Just from Chelsea Flower, Spirited Flight, and Tis Magic. Kitten's Adventure becomes a three time winner. Cole Dickin for the Gary Rich Stable. Down the centre of the course. Chelsea Flower, the white headgear. Spirited Flight's between them. And running on late on number nine, Miss Gibson towards the outside. However, as they come down to the winning post, number 10, Kitten's Adventure, a little bit more in the tank.